The name leopard has its roots in the Greek word lepardus, which is derived from leo, meaning lion, and pardus, representing panther. As a result, therefore, the leopard is also sometimes called a panther. A fun fact, did you know that it was the cheetah that was initially referred to as the leopard? That is because it was initially thought that cheetahs were a crossbreed of lions and panthers. Consisting of tigers, lions, and jaguars, the leopard is the smallest of the big four cats. However, it is still larger than the cheetah. Though resembling a cheetah, the leopard has an unmistakable physical appearance. It has a broad head, a powerful long tail, and a long body supported by four slender legs with rosette-spotted gold-colored coat. They are most famous for their speed, adaptability, ability to climb trees with prey double their weight, and stealth. Being masters of ambush and stealth, they are known to enter villages undetected and steal sleeping dogs during the night. They might look graceful and feline, but don't be deceived into wishing you had one as a pet, because beneath their gentle-looking disposition lies a ferocious nature that has permanently engraved their name in the Black Book of Human-Animal Encounters. But that's a story for later in this video. Let's first discuss just how much they weigh and measure in size. A male leopard is visibly larger than a female. Apart from the visible size difference, another way to distinguish between both genders is that male leopards generally have broader heads and larger paws. Excluding the tail, the leopard would often measure between 4 and 6.5 feet, or 1.2 to 2 meters from its head to its rump, while the tail alone measures between 3.5 and 4.5 feet. That's about 1.1 to 1.4 meters. Males usually weigh between 90 and 200 pounds, or 40 to 90 kilograms. Females, on the other hand, weigh most of the times between 65 and 130 pounds, or about 30 to 60 kilograms. In terms of height, the males of these spotted felines grow between 2 to 2.3 feet. That's more or less 60 to 70 centimeters at shoulder level. There are several subspecies of the leopard, and they can all be found in two continents, Africa and Asia. Leopards are great at adapting to just about any environment, and are found in various habitats such as dense rainforests, woodlands, savannas, deserts, high altitudes such as mountains, swamps, coastal shrubs, etc. They are therefore the most widely distributed of all large cats as their range covers 35 African countries stretching across East and Sub-Sahara Africa. They are also present in Turkey, the Arabian Peninsula, the Himalayan foothills, China, Sinai Judean Desert, India, Sri Lanka, Java, and as far as Eastern Russia. It is across this vast range that the nine subspecies of leopards can be found. One of the major differences among these leopards is their irregular rosette-spotted patterns. These spots are known as rosettes since they resemble the shape of a rose flower. The African leopard, for example, tends to have rosette spots that are circular, while that of Asian leopards tends to be square-shaped. There is a rare kind of leopard, the black panther, with spots difficult to see except under certain light conditions. Having examined its habitat and range, what do they eat? Leopards are carnivores, flesh eaters that would prey on whatever is readily available and within reach. As such, leopards would hunt a plethora of animals depending on the animals available in their location. From large to small, some of the animals they hunt and eat include impalas, guinea fowl, chittle, baboons, springbok, bushbuck, hares, guinan, eland, grey langur, warthogs, doiker, gazelle, snakes, antelope, birds, rodents, zebra, porcupines, and even fish as they are great swimmers, although not as good as tigers. Leopards also do hunt other predatory animals such as foxes, jackals, lion cubs, cheetah cubs, Janet and other leopards, cubs and mature leopards. 
Whatever they can overpower, they would hunt. Relying on stealth, leopards are successful ambush hunters that can spring into speeds reaching 60 kilometers per hour or about 37 miles per hour thanks to powerful legs and retractable claws. They can make sharp turns even at top speed thanks to their long, nimble tails, which act as steering and balance. A leopard can leap over 6 meters or 20 feet forward and jump 10 feet or about 3 meters upwards. They are also the best tree-climbing large cats and can haul prey twice their size up a tree. This is often to ensure that they can always eat their captured prey in peace without disturbance from predatory scavengers such as lions and hyenas that would often try to steal the leopard's prey. A leopard mainly hunts at night, and their eyes have become adapted to nocturnal hunting to the extent that they can see seven times better at night than a human. Their hearing is also five times better than that of humans. When sniffing the air, its whiskers turn backwards. When walking, it faces forward and sideways when sleeping. While leopards may live 10 to 12 years in the wild, they live for up to 25 years in captivity. It is never easy out there in the wild. While you're looking for what to eat, tables can turn quickly and you just may end up becoming another animal's dinner. Though the leopard is a large cat, it is not as large as a tiger or lion. Another bedeviling factor is the solitary nature of this animal. As a result, the leopard is sometimes preyed upon particularly by the following seven predators. These are lions, which account for 20% of leopard deaths, tigers, which are also much larger than the leopard, hyenas, and painted dogs, both of which rely on the power of pack hunting, snakes, such as constrictors, other leopards, since cannibalism is not uncommon, and of course, humans. These predators account for their shorter lifespan in the wild and the decreased population. Since 1986, the International Union for the Conservation of Nature IUCN, has listed the leopard as vulnerable to extinction given its decreasing population trend. The Amur leopard, found in Russia, is the rarest and most critically endangered as there are just about 30 left in the wild. The greatest threat leopards face is due to human activity. Such activities include loss of habitat, poaching, and hunting of leopard's prey for bush meat, especially in Africa where there is a 59% decrease in prey population. In return, it is not uncommon for leopards to hunt dogs and livestock from nearby villages. As a result, humans and leopards have long conflicted. It is, however, a fact that leopards attack and eat humans given the opportunity. Several records showcase how man-eating leopards have terrorized villages in times past. National Geographic, for example, published a story from November 2020 where a man got attacked immediately in Florida when he entered the animal's cage to take pictures with the black leopard. There are many more incidents where a leopard attacked humans. As mentioned earlier, they might look adorable sometimes, but they are carnivorous animals and need to sustain themselves. You should really be careful around them and hold your distance, because these leopards have caused their fair share of human deaths. This magnificent animal is a unique predator in the family of large cats. The leopard is the definition of stealth and strength with its impressive prey-hauling, tree-climbing agility also possessive of five times better hearing and seven times sharper night vision than humans, it would be a shame if this animal became extinct as human activity continues to dwindle its population. The Amur leopard is almost gone. Others could follow suit. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and ring the bell icon to get notifications about our next videos.